Before the AFLW's inaugural season, Giants star recruit Renee Forth ruptured her interior cruciate ligament and required knee reconstruction surgery. Many players suffered similar injuries during this season's AFLW matches. What I've heard is the fact that women are more exposed to doing their ACLs, so yeah, you see that that's going to happen, and I haven't seen many of them being impact. I think there's a stat on how many, there's like one, one per club or two per club in the men's. So I think it's only just that little bit more in the women's, but like I said before, we're more prone to it, so you're gonna see more. She has struggled to reach past exploits during this season's AFLW. You don't go back to where you were. You can't understand what you need to change or how you can get confidence back or how you can get your body to move the way it was. So now it's the most challenging time. Female athletes from other sports have also suffered ACL injuries, including recently retired Australian cricket star Alex Blackwell. I went through a major injury in 2006 where I had a knee reconstruction, which was pretty much a career-threatening injury. And at that moment, I realised that I really need to not take for granted the opportunity to put on the baggy pants. AFLW and Melbourne Demon star Brooke Patterson, who is completing her PhD, Athletes recovering from ACL injury says female athletes are two to three times more likely than their male counterparts in suffering a knee injury whilst playing sport involving jumping and pivoting. She says female specific strengthening programs are required for athletes coming through.